Hello everybody, I'm so excited for today's video because I'm going to be showing you how to make this really awesome Starbucks soap dispenser, which is so easy and cheap to make. So let's get started to making the DIY. So for this DIY, you'll need a Starbucks cup, clay frosting, a frosting tip, a head and pump of the soap dispenser, and a clear plastic sheet. So first I'm going to take a plastic folder and just cut a small section of it because you don't need that much for this DIY and just place the plastic cup on top of the plastic sheet and then taking a marker just trace around the cup to form a round circle. Cut the circle out using a pair of scissors and also make sure that you cut a small hole at the center of the circle as well. So before you start piping whipping cream, I'm going to be rolling up a piece of clay into a snake and just plop it onto a plastic sheet. And that's going to hold the shape of the whipped cream. This step may be optional, but of course, I recommend not to skip it. Then you need some clay frosting, which you can buy at your local craft store. For me, it was already prepared for me in a piping bag, so all I needed to do was to place the icing tip on top of the icing bag. But before you do that, of course you must cut the tip off. Then you just wait for the cream to dry, which basically takes up to like 5 hours to completely dry. Now that everything is completely dried, I'll be taking the plastic top off the Starbucks drink and just stick the soap dispenser pump through the hole of the cap and also the frosting top. And then you just glue all the parts together using your glue gun. Now that the soap dispenser bottle is completed, it's time to fill it with liquid soap, which actually depends on what type of Starbucks drink you choose to make. In this case, I'll be making a strawberry and cream frappuccino. But the liquid soap I already have for now is originally clear, so of course I have to add some coloring to it in order to look like a strawberry frappuccino. By the way, the coloring powder that I'm using is made for coloring soap, but if you don't have that, you can use food coloring. But basically you can use anything you want, just make sure that it's safe for your skin. And here's the completed Starbucks soap dispenser and I really like how this turned out because it looks super cute and it works as a bathroom decoration as well. So the holidays are just around the corner and if you're still trying to figure out what to give to a friend, then I think this DIY will work as a wonderful gift. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you in my next one.